Surrey dominant day one with Ollie Pope Tun. Hampshire are the early pace setters in the LV County Championship, the only side in Division 1 with a win to their name. They travelled to South London in the second round of the competition to face Surrey at the Kia Oval, the hosts having more than held their own in a draw away at the Champions Warwickshire. The visitors won the toss and chose to start with the ball but had to be patient as Ryan Patel and Rory Burns got Surrey off to a decent start in the first hour. But with the clock inching towards 12, it was Ian Holland that separated the two. Burns out, caught in the slips for 21. Patel was now joined by Hashim Amla, and the pair guided Surrey past 50 and beyond, inching their way ever closer to three figures as the session wore on. They were 17 runs shy of the 100 when lunch was called, Patel 11 away from a 50. The opener capitalised after the break, reaching 50 with his 8th 4 lofted over cover. 99 balls taken to get there, 100 runs up for his side in the process. He'd add just 8 more before holing out to James Fuller, caught by a bass on the boundary. That brought Ollie Pope to the middle and immediately the England man struck up an effective partnership with Amla, enough to see the home side past 150 runs. Pope looked in good touch, delicately guiding Holland to the ropes to bring up the 50 partnership. Amla then had a 50 of his own. Three runs off Holland took the veteran to the mark of 116 balls. It was the man at the other end who was catching the eye though. Ollie Pope running fuller down to the third mound boundary and then with the next ball over the ropes for six as they cruised past 200 runs. With that kind of intent on show there was no surprise to see Pope reach 50 runs, raising the bat after a single off fuller, tee taken soon after with the score 212 for two. Amler and Pope continued to tick the score over after the break and they soon found their way to a 100 run partnership when the latter added another boundary to his growing collection. But finally the pair were separated, Ben Brown took the catch as the South African edged through to the new Hampshire keeper. That brought Ben Folkes to the crease, he joined his England teammate and picked up where Amler had left off. It was the Surrey keeper who had his side to 250 with a boundary flashed to the fences off Holland, but attention quickly turned back to Pope, who, with a boundary steered through square leg, reached 100 runs, his first century of the season. There was time left for Surrey to make their way to 300, up to the mark before the close of play, where they'd finished the first day on 312 for three. Pope unbeaten on 113 and looking good for even more. Another fine performance from the England man had set the tone for his side, who will be full of confidence heading into day two. An opportunity to set an imposing total is there for the taking, but Hampshire possess one of the LV County Championship's most potent attacks and will look to prove that when they get back underway on Good Friday.